Hey, this is Angie of Angie's Animal Friends. Now, I know I never make an appearance on the show, but I thought today I would break that tradition because Ryan and I are going on a little trip. This guy scared the dickens out of me. I was just walking by. Hey, you want some fruit? I can get you fruit. Want an apple? Hey, you gonna jump over and get an apple? There we go. Where shall I put it? There you go. There we go. Yeah. You got it? Let's go get it. All right, awesome. Quick and easy. That was quick and Just easy. Like They're that. ready for you. All right, there's a name on it. All right, look. That's me. Yum, yum, yum. Oh, me. All right, Looks cool. like the old graphics I remember. Oh, yeah. yeah. Here we go. Wow, look at that. Vegan options right there on the front. Vegan sandwich here. Oh, I'm excited. Hey, Ike, we should have come here. No, I know. We've only been like. Well, we've been once times. and you've been once. Yeah, it's my favorite the third time. I remember enjoying yeah. it. I remember how large these things are. Yeah, so we only like, got one value. to split. Mm -hmm. We kind of did a custom order on a peewee sandwich. It's vegan turkey and... I don't know if there's a vegan cheese in there, maybe? But yeah, and we added avocado. You said just ask to make anything vegan. That's cool. Oh, and we got it on sourdough bread, by I the way. I see some onions, but it's some purple onions. Don't suck being vegan, guys. <laughs> really don't. I knew I heard the sounds of munching from inside the house here. Look at that little muncher. He's got fruit seed there. Hi, guys. Hi. What's going on? Hi. Okay, they're ready already. So hopefully I can pour some of this out there before getting attacked by raccoons. Hi, Mama. You ready? Okay. Okay. We look ready. God, it's so bright right now for the raccoons to be out. I'm worried my neighbors are going to freak out. Here they come. Hi, Mama. Babies. Oh my goodness. Crunching, munching madness. No, let's not fight with them, Kay. Let's not fight with those guys. Uh oh. Where'd the other two go? I wonder if you guys can tell how big this mother is. She's a lot bigger than my cats. Well, I would say this other brand of vegan kibble is a hit. Definitely want to thank the viewers for contributing to the raccoon fund. Dr. the last Andy's animal friends. Excuse me. Oh, those two got spooked, disappeared. Munching, crunching, mayhem. Huh, this one on the right might be the smallest one here. Wow. And they're going through it pretty quick. Thought I was generous. Hi, BB. Oh, see, I think she's gonna go look for them now. Okay. Uh -uh. Little sibling squabble there. <laughs> 
She's so tiny. Hi, tiny. How are you, tiny? Just a little one. Aww. Better go catch up. There you go. I see him climbing up the tree now. Maybe he's living by tree. I don't know. He's a better than going up to eat figs. Oh, this one. Oh my goodness. Goodness. That's exactly why Ryan doesn't trim the hedges until after spring baby season is over. They're getting pretty overgrown right now, but we're gonna wait until they've all moved on. Hi. Hi, what's that, the mama or a baby? Oh, oh just now look at a baby. Those are babies. Oh my goodness, where's that baby going? <laughs> that could be mama or yeah. a baby, can't tell. I know. But there's a baby behind mama. Oh goodness gracious. That's mama. Yeah, it's mama. She's like, oh, it's that nice lady. Hey mama. Oh, there's another baby off to the right there. Just on the, oh, okay, it's coming towards mama. There it is. Oh, oh, two oh, of them. Oh, babies. there they all are, all, all the babies. babies. I wonder if they eat any of these weird bush cherries. Hm. See, she's coming closer, babe. Hi, Mama. Uh-oh, she's got fleece. Yeah, they seem to be looking for fallen cherries maybe yeah, off of that bush cherry tree. Look at that, she's big. Oh my goodness, the sounds of them. Hi, cutie, are you trying to be scary? Where's she standing? There's one still back. He's looking at you. He's looking at me. There he goes. Oh, so cute. Uh-oh, they're getting in our bougainvillea now. What's their next step? I think in old days, they used to be to crawl on our roof. Yeah. Like in our outing. Maybe they're gonna hide in there from me. All right, I'm gonna go inside. Yeah. Oh, did you eat both of them already? Wow, I heard the chewing and they just ate and everything. Oh, maybe there's something up here. I was hoping you was going to find it. Yeah, I put two moldy Abrams out there. There it goes. He's a little chomper. Oh, yeah, that's the sound. Yeah, I thought it was the sound of water spilling. It sure sounded like water, huh? Yeah. His timing's really good, so he missed all that insanity <laughs> yeah. of five crazy raccoons. I don't know, was it luck or was it time? Like, okay, the raccoons are finally gone now. <laughs> Yeah, they seem so peaceful in comparison to the chaos of a raccoon family. Yeah, I know. Possums are perfect. They just come and they do their business. Oh, he's got, he's coming down. So cute. He's gonna go, I wonder if he'll go straight down the bricks like the raccoons do. Oh, it's gonna clean itself up there first. They're so fastidious. Some people are walking by. A little tiny baby. Hi, tiny baby. They're always hoping for seconds. I don't know if I should train them to keep coming back and back, though. That's how we get into trouble last year. They would just come 
all night long begging for more and more food. It's so cute though, it's hard to resist them. Hi, did you think the food would magically appear? Oh, is that what you're thinking? Hey, Mama. Hi. You want more food, don't you? I know you. Did you guys find some over there? Sounds like you found some. What's going on there? You're just gonna wait? You're just gonna wait on the porch? Oh, you guys. Oh, it's not safe out there for me. Three bowls, five raccoons. Thank you.